Alright, hello everybody, welcome back. This is part four of my let's play of City Skylines. And we are uh, we are in Lake Valley, which I thought I had renamed that. This is Train City. Maybe Train Town. I actually like Train Town. Alliteration is the bomb. I was pretty sure I'd renamed that before I uh, before I ended last episode, but either way, we do have our lovely train system. Oh, and we have a fire next to it. I'm sure that's unrelated. But we do have our lovely train system in now, carrying passengers all over the place. I'm guessing that blue one is a uh, tourist train. No, it says passenger. I don't know. Maybe the uh, the red ones are pa are tourists, and the blue are passenger. Interesting. It looks like we're actually having a fair amount of traffic on that line, and we might want to uh, to run a second track at some point. It might be worthwhile. I'm not sure. We'll have to to investigate that. Uh, but for the moment, we've got thirty-one thousand dollars and demand in every sector. But especially, oh, just switch to especially uh, industrial. Let's build some offices. Let's build a nice little office district. Grab our our two-lane road with, um, with trees here. Actually, I'm going to grab from here since this one does not seem to be. Yeah, it's not lined up to anything. Oh, I just barely misjudged that, it looks like, by one square. I want to make sure those line up really nicely. Bam. And now, for this, I don't want to bring it right here. Well, I guess it's not going to hurt. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. And I'll do the same thing here. There we go. And since we've already got a nice little intersection created for us here, we'll capitalize on it and send it around like that. And I might leave this one blank as an empty space. I think that'd be fine. Oh, that is perfect. I couldn't have planned that better if I'd actually been planning things. I like it. I like the way it looks. It looks functional. It's not maybe not the prettiest thing in the world, but it it'll work. It'll do. The office park isn't going to be the prettiest part anyways, right? Offices. Offices everywhere. So that should help with our residential demand. Yeah, and I'll, I'll zone that uh, low wealth commercial because that's the only thing that's going to be useful there. So that should help with our industrial demand. It's already going down there. And we're going to need a commercial section now. A new commercial section. So the issue with my lovely trains here is I did basically box myself in. If I want to extend this, I either need to make an overpass, or I have to put a railroad crossing, and I definitely don't want to put a railroad crossing. That's going to slow down everybody. So I'm going to try to build an overpass here, as short as I can. There we go. That looks good. I think I managed to keep that mostly straight. Uh, now, I wanted to do another one, like, right here, but this is not much room. Uh, oh, yes, we can do it. Yes. Yes. Victory. There we go. So we are, we are working on a new commercial district over here on the other side of the, uh, of the railroad. And let's bring it a little bit farther out. It looks like it does not want to go straight, though. There we go. That looks pretty straight. If I can judge that just right. Perfect. And let's send a little uh, two-lane road. Not a one-way, please, though. I think I'll send a middle branch out. Oh no, I made it. Oh no, okay, we didn't make a railroad crossing. Whew, that was close. We'll send this out in a little T-junction like this. And we'll probably plant some nice trees around here or something to make it look pretty. Maybe build a nice big park. Uh, let's zone that up with some high-density commercial, though. Oop, wait, 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 before we do that, make sure we run the pipeline. It looks like we've got some useless, uh, electric lines here anyways that I can blow up. Yeah, these are definitely not necessary anymore. Uh, but this line still is, just not that, that split-off branch there. So we can zone up all the rest of this, though, as, uh, as high-density commercial. That'll be a nice brand new uh, commercial district. Handle that commercial demand. Now we've got a lot of residential demand. I am going to put a park down though before I forget. 
like to use one of the uh, especially large ones since we've got such a nice big uh, empty space there. Bam. I like it. I think it looks good. That'll be a nice little office park with our nice little uh, overpasses there on the other side. So I think those are our first overpasses in the entire city. It's the first time I've actually needed them. All right, so next thing we are, well, let's, uh, while I was taking a look at parks, I do want to poke around and make sure that there's no other areas like this one that really, really need a park. Something like that. Maybe another one. Yeah, they're okay now. Need a park down here, I guess, in the corner. And maybe one more down over here somewhere. Bam. Looks good. I do need to start planning some more freeways, I think. It might make sense to bring uh, the freeway along back here as well. We can probably purchase another... Uh, yeah, we can. We can purchase at least one more. This one might be a good one to take. Let's purchase it. Wow, we have 160,000. In that case, I'm going to buy the next one right next to it as well. There we go. So that gives us a lot more space to play now. We're not going to be limited with these train lines to uh, keeping them right on that line. Excelente! What else do we need? Electricity's looking fine, water's fine, garbage. Landfill usage is pretty high, uh, but we have plenty of incinerator capacity, so hopefully we'll stay on top of that. Healthcare could be better. Could be better. We have, looks like, one clinic all the way up there. Let's build something, something new. Maybe right out here, space already occupied. Bam! That's our hospital. And fire department. Fire hazard's pretty low. Looks like, uh, well, we do have the fire station over here, so that should be good enough. How's the police uh, doing? Very low crime rate. I like it. Education. Elementary school is okay. Oh, we need a university. How have I neglected a university for so long? You know what? Let's, let's plan a really pretty university. Lots of parks and, and trees and, and gorgeous roads. That's what I want to do. I'm going to take it right from here. A nice, uh, a nice tree path there. We're going to break it off into two one-block segments. Bring those down two blocks. I like that. And oop, wrong one. How is the university going to want to be placed? So it's going to want to be placed on a road, so we'll want to bring a road across there. Let's bring a, uh, I'm going to put just grass so that we can see the, see the uh, university a little bit better in all of its glory. Let's put this right in the middle. Perfect. So that is our, our glorious university. And it's complaining about not having any water. We'll fix that real quick just so that it's useful while I'm doing all this. And now, I'm going to start using some parks here, I think, to begin with. I'm not sure which. Oh, I have to put this somewhere. I got this from a mod. This is the Better Call Saul billboard from, uh, from the Steam Workshop. Absolutely necessary. It's got to go in some kind of an industrial area. Yep, it's going to go down here near our trail, or our, near our train, train uh, department. There we go. Better Call Saul Goodman. I love it. I love that show. Great show if you haven't watched it yet. AMC. Alright, back to what I was doing. Where is that? There we go. There's our... Our new university. So, I was looking at parks. I also have this nice sunken plaza that we can add in somewhere. Uh, we're probably not going to have a basketball court in the front. Not a dog park. It wouldn't be a playground. A park with trees, maybe? Oh wow, it's really, really big. Oh no, but this is just... Oh, it's an, an odd sh an odd size. What about if we put it on the side? No, it's just not going to look right. It's got to be symmetric. So is this one. Do I have a symmetric number or a uh, even number of blocks here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So there are an even number of blocks, which means that the parks are, are like fives. They must be like five and three meters wide, or uh, blocks wide. 
for most of them. Oh, that is so frustrating. It's maddening. Yep, they all look like they are five blocks wide. Dang it. And skate park's not going to look right. All right, we'll have to do this all with, uh, slow the time on down here a little bit. We're going to have to do this all with, uh, with pretty little gravel paths and stuff. I'm going to run two paths parallel here, right down the middle. And let's grab some uh, some pretty trees. Which of these trees are we going to want to use? Actually, this should probably be bushes right down the middle, right? These little, nice little bushes. Oh man, this is going to be so difficult to line these up right. It'll be worth it when it's done. Oh man, they're varying in size. That's going to drive me nuts, too. Well, that looks terrible. It would look better if they hadn't varied themselves in size so dang much. Maybe if we connect them, it'll look a little bit better. Some of them are just really a heck of a lot bigger than the other ones. That is so unfortunate. Alright, come on, let's do this. I do want this to look really nice though. This is supposed to be like the gem. Other than the trains. The trains are a gem in and of themselves. But our glorious university. Maybe these will be, I don't know. Like the shaped topiaries that you see where they're like an elephant or a giraffe or something like that. Maybe that's what this is. And we just can't understand because we don't live in the world, bro. Well, that looks horrible. Okay, well, that's how that's going. But uh, I guess I'll have to make do. Let's see if we can line it with some pretty trees that aren't going to change size. They are going to change size, consistently. Yep, there's a baby tree. I wonder if there's a mod that fixes that. Let's you set the size of the tree. It's okay, it'll still look pretty nice. I'm not going to be too sad about it. It'll still look like a pretty nice little, uh, college... Yeah, we don't have any fountains or anything. Yeah, that still looks pretty nice. It doesn't look bad. It still looks pretty, uh, pretty epic. Let's, uh, let's put some little parks along the edge. Plaza with picnic tables that would take up all of the space. That's cool. We'll put that right there, and we'll put another one on the other side. Bam. Yeah, they're gonna complain about electricity, whatever they want to do. And we'll mirror these on either side. I didn't even look at what this is. Plaza with trees. Plaza... Blah, 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 blah. That's too big. That's just one square off. What about the sunken plaza? That might look really cool. It would, but it's a little small. Why don't we put those on either side of the, uh, the university here? Well, it's starting to look like university. It's too bad these are, are a completely different color. Uh, wrong thing. I'm going to run a gravel path right along the outside edge of those, just so they look a little bit cohesive. Bam. That's not looking bad. I don't think that looks bad at all. Maybe we can continue this this way. Delete that stupid tree that's in the way. There we go. And then we could fill this in with a few other pretty trees. I'm liking the way this looks. It's looking pretty good. Wow, those are really big. That's awesome. I'm going to use these to frame it.
This is going to be a very foresty college. That's okay. That's a pretty college. Get a nice, uh, nice view while you're paying fifty thousand dollars a year. It's the least you can ask for. Some, some freaking trees, right? There we go. Almost there. There it is. Now, aside from the uh, the little electricity problem, which hopefully I can solve without totally destroying this. Yes, I can. I can run it right back through here. Oh, that's a uh, train line right. Oh, we will still have no problems running it along the train. And like that. And that should count my, like, one tiny square short. No, it counted. There we go. So there we go. There is our college. Our university is really what it is. And I think it looks pretty great. I'm pretty happy about it. University. Alright. The land values around there are going to be super high, too, because of all those parks. Yeah, those people are really, really happy about living next to the university. Cannot blame them. Alright, time to move on. We have a huge demand for residential that I've completely ignored. And in the meantime, we've, we've earned 186,000 buckaroos, so it's time to, uh, to do some expansion here. Um, I do want to do this in a, in a really pretty way, though, and I'm thinking about bringing this freeway over to allow some better, uh, better access, since we have a train station. Wait, do we have a train station right here? No, we don't, but we have one in there. So over here would be a good place to, uh, to end that freeway. Let's do a little interchange. This one. So if I, I build it right around here, we'll have to blow up, obviously, a lot of freeway. I'll pause the game. Yeah, you can demolish the burn building. It's fine. I'm going to blow up a whole lot of this because I want to smooth these out when I get back. There we go. And I'm going to actually swing around here to, to get an idea of, of how I want this to uh, to go. Something kind of like this. There we go. Make sure I get the directions right. There we go. Wow, that is really... Let's just delete a little bit more of the, uh, the freeway here. There's no need for it to curve this direction. Yeah, that'll make it, well, it'll almost make it easier. Unfortunately, it looks like I placed this one. I don't know if I placed this one or if the game placed that one. I think I did, but it, it's a little bit off. <laughs> Just a little bit. So that's fine. We'll figure it out. And I'm going to make this a curved road. That's way too curved. Well, it looks okay. this to be perfect. I really do wish they had a parallel tool. There we go. That'll have to do. There we go. I'm happy with it. It's good enough. Let's bring the freeway down a little ways. Those are pretty parallel, at least. There we go. I just brought it almost the entire way just so that I could keep it there in case I'm going to expand later. I'm sure I'll need this space eventually. Yeah, we're kind of boxing our little city in here. 
Alright, let's make a nice little exit here. I tend to build these by hand. And we have no cars on the road, so I can't see the directions. Alright. I'm going to line this up as best I can. I kind of wanted to use this piece of road, and I think I can snake it underneath that, uh, that train exchange. Oop, 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 oop. Looks like we are massively out of power. I'm not sure how. Oh, our freeway interrupted our power line. There we go. Minor issue, minor problem, nothing to be concerned about. Nope, and it's saying no go. I think there's a pillar right in the way. Yep, there is. A couple of pillars. Yep, no way that's gonna go. So we can't use that bit of road. And if we use this one, we would have to make a train crossing. Maybe we can do this, which is not pretty at all. But it does get the job done. There we go. And, oh, this is actually, this is a six lane. Oh, okay, my bad. Redo all of that. I definitely want to take advantage of the six lane there. Should be a little bit tighter on the spacing. Yeah, it's already giving me a little bit more of a complaint. Try this one more time. There we go. And then we can delete this little corner here. And let's bring this on down. And now we can work on our, uh, our on-ramps and off-ramps. Refresh my memory about which direction. Alright, this is this bound means that we're going to want something, let's put this into uh, free form, there we go, and am I going to want them to be able to get on to, or to get off of this, yeah I guess, I guess I am. There we go. So that's one direction connected, nice and easy. Nice and simple. The uh, the opposing direction is never quite as easy. So let's get an off-ramp going for it. Oops, sorry there. Let's bring that up a level. Bring it down now. Put it into straight mode. Perfect. And now for the on-ramp. I wonder if I'd be able to snake it around through there. Probably not, but I'm going to try. Let's see if we can work some magic here. Maybe we'll need to send it through the outside edge. Yep, I think that's exactly what we're going to have to do here. Well, it's not the ugliest, to be honest, and it's... I'm pretty okay with that. That is not too bad. We'll plant some, uh... not these. Where are the really big ones? Yeah, nice big trees in the middle of that intersection. Hide some of the ugliness. There we go. That'll help. Makes it look a little bit more rustic and natural. Alright. We want it to be at least kind of pretty when you're driving around town, right? 
That matters a little bit. Okay, and all of that, and I still have not zoned a single <laughs> residential section. It's gotta get done. Oops. Absolutely gotta get done. So I'm gonna take the uh, sixth lane here. And right here along the train track, I'm gonna extend it all the way down. Do the same thing on this side. Or not because of... Oh, look at that. The pillar is just barely... Okay, then we will move the entire road up one square. That sucks. There we go. And we'll send this one down this way again. Bam. Maybe I'll elevate this this entire section of rail so that I can connect these. I might do that. That seems worthwhile. It would certainly free up uh, some of this road congestion as well. A project for another day, I think. Let's uh, let's continue on ahead with uh, the six lanes here. And we will spiral this inward with the two lanes. Something like that. And we will do maybe three or four little branches inward. So close. There we go. Bam. Let's water this and we will zone it for residential and, and be done with it. I'm going to actually extend a very long pipe here because I'm anticipating to, uh, to use all that space. Let's zone that up with uh, high density residential. It's going to have some noise complaints but we'll put a nice park and they'll shut up about it I think. Let's put the botanical gardens. Those are really pretty. Bam. That should be good. Let's go ahead and speed up time. And watch the people move in. And as we watch them move in, guys, that is going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.